Hi guys, my name is Orc and welcome to back to my channel. Today we are going to talk about the Apex Legend, something new on my channel. And I have been playing a lot. Uh, I have managed in my 25 level, uh, something like that. I, I managed to get around 30, maybe 40 wins in that line, I think. That is pretty much, I think that's decent to be honest. And today's we have uh, five tips to talk about that I think gonna help you all and me as well to win more games that we play. So this is not in particular order. So I'll just start with the first. I think in this game, one of the biggest thing is that a wep uh, your weapon of choice. Basically, what I mean, uh, most demi, uh, more like the guns with high DPS is absolutely the best for you. Uh, I'm playing on PlayStation. I'm playing on PC as well, and I found a couple of this weapon is really, really good. Uh, first one is Air 99 SMG gun. I feel like uh, this gun is so good on PC. A little bit less on PlayStation on console, but for PC, it's uh, extremely good. Next thing is assault rifle is called air r301 uh, uh, it is uh, used light uh, light bullets and extremely good accurately both for playstation and pc and uh, overall really good high damage uh, high dps gun why i said this is the better just because the people here has probably around 200 health and can easily easily uh, heal up and uh, the gunfights itself are much longer than we are used in call of duty and that's why high dps guns are better in my opinion or LMG, my favorite gun is a uh, Spitfire uh, LMG, extremely good, high damage, high fire rate, and I love it. Only problem, you use heavy bullets and lot, a lot of heavy bullets. Uh, snipers, I want to talk a little bit of, there are a couple of them and every single one of them are actually good, usable. The only problem with snipers, they're most used as um, some pre-damage, pre-gunfights uh, damage, not rather the gunfight itself. They're really good at picking up someone, not killing them, but making making a lot of damage while you're pushing them. That's I think the best use uh, sniper's rifle in this game at the moment. And I want to mention one uh, pistol as well, that's Wingman. This gun is a beast, it's extremely good. Uh, not a lot of bullets to be honest, use heavy bullets. And uh, especially on PC, extremely good, especially if you add, um, how it's called. There is attachment for multiplier, for higher multiplier headshot damage. Basically when you hit that, if you have that attachment on, uh, your damage Damage, I think it's 90, 90 per headshot or, or or 100. Like two shots will kill every single one person. Basically, it's extremely good. I'm sure it's gonna be nerfed, but I think at the moment extremely good. Next thing is basically a champion of choice, and uh, to my, to be honest, on my surprise as well, it doesn't it doesn't care what champion you're playing. I want to say lifeline is extremely good to have on uh, your team just because of the heals, just because of uh, care package, but every single one of them every single is good uh, usable in every situation they all go really well with each, with, uh, each other and basically you don't need to care if you don't have a high dps guy or you have like rate on your team or something every single one is good and usable and go extremely well with each other champion in the game and that being saying i already said the lifeline is extremely good just because of the heals and everything and i would highly suggest you if you see there's no lifeline on your team play your lifeline play a lifeline but on the other hand a really good you don't you don't need to care about that too much because every single champion is extremely good so basically if you don't like lifeline play whatever you want and it's gonna be good next thing i want to uh no want to talk about is landing and landing late especially uh before uh we go in that uh when you start the game you're basically directly inside of the um some kind of aircraft and you have a couple of seconds like i think five seconds to uh make your mind where you want to go and i highly suggest location itself is not that important to be honest depends what you want to play life uh, uh, long game they want to kill a lot of people go in high uh, high loot places and something like that but in the end it doesn't matter too much uh, if you find a gun that's gonna be really good for you in the beginning uh, but the problem with this is if you're landing late you need to make your mind really fast we are going there that's it done if you're late something don't jump choose another location where you're not will not be late just because give, going late somewhere especially in high loot places Places, mean the other team probably already have a gun and they're aiming right for you so that's not gonna end really well for you next thing i want to talk is pings there are such a good uh pings uh, system in this game uh, there is no excuses for uh being call out for calling out bad especially the uh enemy location ping that's extremely use useful uh, because if you say somebody he is behind the tree and there is a lot of tree here. what the fuck what tree what do you mean where is he just ping him 
team and please don't be that guy on the team who pings random shit on the map and uh, because you can ping a lot of uh, like i think seven stuff if i'm not mistaken or eight and there is people on the team that just using enemy ping and i went there there is no one it's not even looted place so don't be that guy on team please please don't be that guy it's so annoying and uh, really not good for your team as well and the last thing i want to talk about and i think this is a thing that are not a lot of people going and i see by the game that we won on this way is high ground high ground is so so good in this game especially uh because there is not no uh jump damage basically when you land somewhere from high ground there is no zero damage that you get and that's extremely good high ground also mean that you will be able to see them a little bit more than they a couple of seconds more than they have uh, they have basically can see you so that means there you have a little advantage on the high ground as well just because you can see them a little bit uh, faster and earlier basically and i think there is a lot of people don't use that also on the map there is a shit ton of zip uh, zip lines that can uh, get you really high there is a uh, lot of steps and the uh, jump uh, also the jump you can jump quite high, uh, high basically you can climb up the wall and a little bit of jump and he will boost he will boost up yourself on better good high ground position and that's how you win how you win the gunfight and also with that i want to mention in the end self uh the aim and how good you can uh, land your shots are extremely important in this game and uh, people with extremely good aim can easily outgun you in any situation it meant no matter what you have any kind of advantage on them or not anyway thank you for watching this video make sure to leave a like share and subscribe and i'll see you guys some other day with new video peace out